Now this is the system I've got going on in the caravan. As you can see, when it stops regulating the power, it's generating about 8-9 amps and it jumps to 38 amps. That's because, well I don't know why that does that, but never mind. The two solar panels, 280 watt solar panels, are on roof at caravan. They're charging these 110 amp batteries. There's one there, there's one in that box there. Also, when I'm connected to mains or a generator, I use this 600 watt grid tie inverter. This obviously helps power the thing and stops my generator from revving so much, so it'll save me a bit of fuel. And uh, obviously, when you've got mains on, the battery charges on, so the solar panels aren't doing anything. And if I turn the main breaker on here, it should start up like that. As you can see the lights are now flashing round. And it does this because I've got a little 12 volt transformer just here. Which powers the relay, which switches between sending power to the batteries and the inverter. And now, if you look at the little electricity on it, you can see that it's generating 75 watts. You may also know that on the other videos, I've got, I used a 300 watt grid tie inverter. Um, this one actually gives out a higher amount of power because it doesn't get so hot being 600 watt it, I think it's warm but I found that uh, at, lower power cons at lower power outputs it doesn't give out as much power as the 300 watt does so um, probably better off at 300 watt with only 160 watt of solar panel I actually bought this inverter from a wind turbine, but I decided to dump the wind turbines load into hot water uh, as I already generate more than enough electricity that I can use anyway. Thanks for watching the video.